can see it in mitosis a diploid cell a parent cell which is diploid is exactly like the daughter cell which are also diploid so we can say that in mitosis the daughter cells are exactly identical to the parent cells but in meiosis the parent cell are diploid and the daughter cells are haploid so here daughter cells are not identical to the parent cell nor to other daughter cells so they are unique in this case and if there is any mistake in the mitosis then it would result in lethal diseases like cancer tumor formation or malfunctioning and if there is any uh, mistake in the meiosis or you can say that if there is any problem in the segregation of chromosome or there is no equal distribution of chromosome in each daughter cell then it would also result in serious physical mental disorder here we will um, study the main differences between mitosis and meiosis phases for example this is a parent cell which is diploid both these are the parent cells so you can say that in mitosis how these chromosomes are arranged in mitosis single chromosomes in the form of single chromosomes so single chromosomes would be arranged in the metaphase plate you can see here in this diagram so these single chromosomes are here arranged but in meiosis chromosomal pairs are arranged in prophase 1 or you can say that um, in the metaphase plate in the form of homologous chromosomes. Homologous chromosomes are those chromosomes which are not exactly identical to each other but they are similar. So you can see that these chromosomes present here, these are in the form of pairs and they are aligned and here crossing over also occur but in mitosis there is no crossing over. Next you can see that in mitosis sister chromatids are here separating which results in two um, diploid daughter cells and in meiosis chromosomes are here separating where the spindle fibers and you can see two haploid daughter cells would be formed here. Here four chromosomes which are diploid. Here each daughter cell would have two, two chromosomes in it which we call half number of chromosomes are present in the daughter cell so they are haploid.